Now, I think the thing to call out is that if you have an agent that excels at complex multi-domain workflows, where the alternative is hiring expensive specialists, what you have is still a premium automation tool rather than a general productivity app. We keep coming back to this idea that there are certain buckets in the agentic landscape that are more specialized than others and where you're going to be paying more as a result. And one of the things I want you to take away from this is that AI agents should not be viewed as a singular bucket anymore. You have agents that are going to be positioned as general productivity tools, and you have agents that are going to be positioned as specialist tools for specialist tasks. Manus, as it stabilizes, is looking more and more like a specialist tool for a specialist task. It's looking like a surgeon's scalpel versus a Swiss army knife. I'm sure they would like to be a Swiss army knife from an economics perspective, but because of the engineering challenges I've identified earlier in this video, it's a really hard position for a multi-agent orchestrator to be in.